Welcome to Stonk Insights, your one-stop shop for stock and crypto analysis and discovery. In today's video, we're going to be talking about Helium h &T Mining. Just giving you an update to my mining situation. I know I haven't made a Helium mining video in some time, so I'm going to show you some updates to my mi mining situation. Just give you an update on Helium mining as a whole. So, you know, the Helium mining, if that's the topic that interests you, please stick around for the whole video. Like the video if you like the video. It does help me out. I don't know anything about that YouTube algorithm, but it does help your boy out and I do appreciate it. We are on the way to a thousand subscribers. You know, one of my goals I want to make for this year before we hit 2022 is I want to hit a thousand subscribers. Now, I know that's a lofty goal. That's a, this is a pretty lofty goal from where I'm at right now, but it is my goal and it's something that I want to do. So if you want to help me out with that, please hit that subscribe button. I do appreciate it. Okay. So we're starting here with this video that I made about Helium. This is one of my most popular crypto videos. So thank you guys again for watching it. And the reason why we're here is because, you know, I do want to highlight a, a comment. This Nathaniel Fuentes wrote, $10 a month is good money. So I, I reviewed all my Helium mining videos or anything Helium mining or Helium, you know, anything about Helium. I reviewed them all. And I, I don't remember saying in any of those videos that $10 a month was good money okay so i do want to clarify that you know in these videos you don't see like huge earnings from what i'm making so far but like i said we keep on improving and like i said in this video we're going to be talking about the pretty much the last improvement i have for this helium hotspot miner that i have here in my place okay and then you know that's putting it up on a roof i'm just going to be showing you all the parts that I, you know all that i got for that but i just want to highlight that okay so you know this isn't me trying to shell helium mining to anyone you know if you want to mine that's up to you but you know ten dollars a month i don't know where that came from in this video i can only think of you know my original hotspot placement was in front of a window like on my first level and that obviously was in a great spot so i wasn't gonna be making a, a bunch of helium and i had the stock antenna so right now you know we're still up in the attic you know with the antenna up in the attic like i showed in one of my previous videos so tomorrow or the next day you know i do have a pretty busy schedule we are going to be going up to the roof and i'm going to be showing you the setup that i have okay all right so what we're going to really quickly talk about is the proof of coverage version 11. so this is a new update that's coming to the helium network okay and i don't want to get real deep into it but i do want to go over some of the things that you want to make sure that you have done before this update rolls out so you can begin the most out of you know getting the mo most rewards that you possibly can get okay so just go to these action items okay step one ensure your hotspot is asserted in the correct location okay so if you ever seen any helium video that i made you see like a little hexagon that's on a map so you want to make sure this is staying stating that if you're in this hexagon you want to make sure that what you see in the helium explorer is where you're at okay and if you have to update your location it costs ten dollars in us and but it's charging data credits which it comes out to just over a million data credits but if you don't have the data credits then it just pulls from the h t that you have and burns that step two you have to search your antenna so you got to have the correct antenna you want to have the correct antenna the correct elevation that the antenna is at okay all these things are going to be a part of this proof of coverage version 11 this is real important so that you can have the right data that helium is looking for and earn h and t in correspond and to update the antenna and you know the elevation is only 55 cents in us which is 55,000 data credits in the helium app this third step okay i mean everyone's going to do this this is my, this is me doing a third step okay it's encouraging other hotspot owners to update you know their location and their antenna gaze to make sure that it's the correct okay i think all hotspots start at zero meters in a 1.2 dbi gain and for the longest time you can keep those stats and still reap the rewards of having you know like a better antenna with a better elevation but now they're seeing that that's not going to no longer be the case you got to have the correct elevation and correct the correct antenna when moving forward with helium so i don't think this has been released yet i believe it's october 4th or somewhere around that point where this is going to be released but once that is released you know for not updating these things it will have an effect on how much helium you can earn okay and that's without getting too far into you know what 
the POC version 11 is. If you wanted to, you can go to blog.helium.com and one of their blogs goes over, you know, proof of coverage version 11, what that means for me and you, okay? I highly recommend you guys looking that up. And, you know, if, if nothing else, even if you don't, to follow these steps, you know, to make sure that, you know, your, your location is asserted correctly, you have the right elevation asserted correctly, and the right antenna gain asserted correctly, okay? So what we're gonna get into, we're just gonna go through Amazon, just look at some of my pickups, and then I'm gonna actually show the build that I have, okay? So first thing is this two pack of grounding rods, okay? So I got a two pack, I have three miners, but I'm gonna be using the other one immediately with the other antenna that I have, okay? So this is a grounding rod, this is because I'm gonna be having the antenna outside, I'm gonna need something to ground the device with, and it also dissipate any static electricity that may be coming into the antenna, okay? See this two pack here, 36 bucks. All right, so I got this, this is obviously just a cordless drill. I have a drill, but I don't have a cordless one. So with me being on the roof, I just want to make sure that it has something that, you know, was up there and I didn't have to have any type of cords up there. So I've got this cordless drill here. It's pretty good so far. I haven't used it, but I had enough stuff with it, which was awesome. Then we have this grounding wire, okay? So this is gonna be connected directly to my lightning arrestor, which I'm gonna show you that, okay? So this is gonna be connected to my lightning arrestor and this, and then from the lightning arrestor, is gonna go to the grounding uh, rod that we just seen, okay? Nothing too big. 50 feet, I got 50 feet of it. Uh, a little bit over just because, like I said, I have the other antenna and the other uh, other one of these, these mountain poles. So I've got two of these as well. So I got two mountain poles, the 50 feet of the wire. We got two lighting registers, two antennas. So I have this as well. Let's just see. This just gives some of the dimensions of it right here. So you can see it's 34 inches tall from you know the base there. Not so wide. You know, so it's pretty cool. 27 bucks so I got two of them so $54 uh, what I also got I don't have it yet though is um I picked up this let's see if I can throw this up some picked up this helium hotspot custom LMR 400 ultra flex cable okay I got two lengths of 15 feet okay with the RP SMA male connector on one side and the end male connector on the other side so you see that price, well, let's see, 33 plus 5, 38 plus 5, 43. So 44 bucks times two, so uh, 88 bucks. I got two of these wires here, which is awesome, okay? But I don't have this yet. This is supposed to be coming tomorrow or else this would have already been up and we, I would have been showing that video as well. So there will be a video of me putting this up on my roof, okay? But I just want to show you the parts. And what we're going to get into now or next you know just to wrap this video up i'm going to be getting on my phone here and just showing everything put together okay so that what, what i'm going to take to the road so stick around for that all right ladies and gentlemen uh this is pretty big okay so that's why i'm kind of step back i'll i'm going to go up closer to when you know i'm looking at the lightning arrestor or whatnot but this is how it looks like in the box okay I got two of them. This is the one that's still in the box. Just giving you dimensions. Uh, the uh, drill set that I showed you guys here. This is the cable here. 50 feet. And we're connecting to this monstrosity here. So this is one of them that I already got taken out. Two there. 34 inches there. To so show you this, this connection here, okay? So this is how I got uh, my antenna connected to the pole here. You guys can see that. And then here at the bottom, you see the lightning arrestor is connected directly to the antenna, okay? And then this green cable in here, I'm gonna you know, put it in there, crimp it down, and then have that going to the uh, grounding rod, which is the two grounding rods in this box here, okay? So that's, that's it right there. Um, I'm also going to be picking up a leveler tomorrow. I, I can't find mine, but you know, just to make sure that this is correctly, you know, 90 degrees when I put it up there, so it's not, you know, tilted any way or the other. Um, I'm also going to probably ground this uh, mounting pole, so everything's going to be grounded. You know, the dispatch, this dissipate all static electricity. And just make sure everything's static, okay? So it's not anything too heavier 
okay so thank you guys for watching you know like i said if you like this video if you like these type of videos talking about helium you want to see this install here you know go ahead and subscribe hit that like button i do appreciate it thank you guys for following along for this ride and i'll catch you in the next one peace